Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, Chris Burns Outdoors. Today I just want to review the right height turret mount. Um, I use this for my live scope. You know, some mount, you know, otherwise you'd have to put the live scope up to your trolling motor. And the way I fished, that just wasn't feasible for me. So what I did was I, I went ahead, I spent the money and bought this, bought this mount. And man, it works pretty good. I'm able to keep spot lock on. And I can pan around, and check different, check the area around me while I'm fishing. Maybe the bait fish moved or something, and I'm out in deep water fishing smallmouth, and I'm able just to scan around and be able to check uh, check what I'm fishing in my area around me. So this is a pretty cool mount. Um, so basically, it's got a uh, this foot pedal here, guys kind of see that foot pedal and if you look up you'll see that arrow move see that arrow move now I'm on spot lock right now and I'm able to pan pan around me 180 degrees each way it's got is guys it just mounts right to your trolling motor your Minn Kota trolling motor it's made to fit different motors you pop a couple of the Allen screws out and it bolts right to the bottom um, you kind of see down there uh, you got a space between your trolling motor and the in the mount itself it's also made for 360 you can put 360 on it it comes with a longer um, a longer shaft um, I also guys purchased I purchased this here um, this is a mount that goes on and basically what it does is if you kind of look it kind of mounts like that and if you're in weeds or whatever um, it, won't, it won't bend your it won't bend the mount in um, I, I see I kind of think it, it takes away from it, it slows it down a little bit and in cold weather I've had some problems with it uh, their customer service was awesome was is I think that stripped the inside I had to send it in they turned it right around got it back to me real quick um, so it's a pretty good mount they're not cheap I think at the time I spent 650 bucks you can kind of see I'm just panning around and I'm stuck I'm in one spot right now I'm coming up to the bank you can kind of see where I'm going on the bank there which is pretty cool um anyway i thought i would just do a quick video on that guys uh just something that uh, maybe maybe one of you guys want to try out i just thought i'd give a quick review i i like it it's been great for me but uh anyway hope you liked the video please like subscribe and uh comment down below if you guys got any other questions on this mount, i'll be happy to answer them uh that's the right height mount for garmin live scope and that's by turret it mounts the different ones this is the all tracks i know it goes to the, i think they've got it now for the ghost you don't have to take your trolling motor apart or any of that you pop out two screws you pop this mount in it bolts right to it if you want 360 you just get a longer shaft 360 mounts to that as well um, i'm not quite sure how the 360 goes i don't have that yet guys but uh when i did buy it i told them that i was going to get the 360 they went ahead and sent me an extra shaft i think that was free um anyway um, anyway guys hope you all have a great day uh good luck fishing this fall transition yeah you can kind of see here leaves are changing in behind me um i'm on lewis smith lake beautiful lake a um, little windy out today guys hope you can hear this video anyway talk to y'all later